We live in a world today that's giving us constant feedback. Whether you receive it from a Facebook or Instagram post you recently uploaded, or a notification from your fitness app on your smartwatch telling you a summary of your daily activity. Feedback is literally all around us. Even you, as a healthcare provider, have probably received some form of feedback from your patients, whether positive or negative, on your Google or social media pages. Okay, but let me get to my point here. The point I'm trying to make is that we're all so flooded with electronic, fast-paced feedback that we practically don't pay attention to it. It's all just noise. Now, sending letters has been on its way out for so long that even mentioning it as an option to you is almost nostalgic. Letters haven't been the most popular mode of communication for what seems like 100 years, but that's actually made the art of writing letters that much more thoughtful. Hi everyone, I'm at Moneypenny from eTactics, and today I'm going to tell you the actual health benefits of writing your patients thank you letters. But before we get started, make sure you subscribe to our YouTube channel by clicking the button below. While you're down there, hit that alert bell icon right next to it so that when we post new helpful content, you get notified. Let me ask you this quick question. When's the last time you received a handwritten letter or note? Now I'm not talking about the birthday card that gets passed around the office where people take 30 seconds to sign it. I'm talking about a thoughtful note that thanks you for doing something. I imagine that for most of us, we've only received a handful of these in our lifetime. Most of them are probably from graduation parties or weddings. While you were reading these though, how did they make you feel? Well, if you're like most of us, reading a handwritten thank you letter addressed to you makes you feel pretty good. That's because there are actual health benefits associated with them. Now, according to a Kent State University study, writing and reading thank you letters leads to fewer health problems, decreases in negative feelings, and an improved immune system. Now, if you're a doctor, it's safe to say that one of the main reasons why you pursued your career in the first place was to help treat patients and get them healthy. So if writing thank you letters to your patients acts as another way to boost their health, that's a bonus. So sit down once a week and reflect on the appointments you've had with patients over the past week or so. Take an hour or 60 minutes and write them each personal thank you letters that tell them how thankful you are for them and their continued loyalty to your practice. You could even point out things they did during their recent appointment that was very helpful. Be your genuine self throughout and send them through the mail when you're ready to go. Wait until they come back to your office for their next appointment and watch how they'll come in with a huge bright smile on their face because of the compliments that you gave them in the thank you letter that you sent to them. There are so many positives that happen as a result of writing thank you letters to your patients. But above everything is that they give actual health benefits. It's an ancient way to communicate to one another, but that's what makes it such an opportunity to stand out from all the others as a healthcare practice. Now, if you'd like to learn more about the health benefits of writing thank you letters, reach out to eTactics. And you already made it this far into the video, so you might as well like it, share it, and comment below. But well, what are you waiting for? Subscribe to our channel.